Hello, good evening. <clears throat> we'll now talk about uh, machine design. Ngayon, particularly, pagdating ng ating machine design, we will focus about yung bolts and power screws. So, let's go with our discussion. Okay. Now, mas maganda kasi para maintindihan natin yung bolts and power screws, mas maganda i-apply natin sila ito different problem. Pero bago yun, kailangan, malaman muna natin ano ba yung mga iba't ibang uri ng bolts and power screws. Yung mga parts ng isang power screw, anong uri ng mga threads ang meron siya. And then, how would you determine the amount or the value of your torque on different parts of the power screw? Okay? <clears throat> now, ito yung discussion. Now, I have summarized all the formula na kailangan mo dun sa iyong power screw. Okay? Now, meron mga mga parts dyan, distinct parts, na kailangan mo tandaan. Number one, meron kang screw, meron kang collar, okay? And then, meron kang thread, sa, sa thread mo, meron kang makukuha doon na different values of torque. Okay? Now, yung torque naman na yun, nagbabary yan. Depende kung meron ang uniform pressure, if your thread is bago, or uniform wear if yung thread mo is worn out na. Now, for a thread, yung torque na, how will you get the torque of the thread? Okay? You have to take note of this formula. Okay? Sir, ano ba yung FT? Yung FT is the friction coefficient on your thread. And then, W is the uh, Uh, width of the uh, width ba yan? Ayan, weight of the load that is applied to your uh, screw. And then RMT. Depende yan kung sa problem wala siyang binigay. So that is uniform pressure. Ibig sabihin brand new yung thread mo. Pag sinabi naman yung uniform wear, ibig sabihin nyo gamitin mo yung formula na ito. Okay? Ito yung pagbago, new, new threads or old. Now, meron pang isang formula dyan. Okay? Ibinibigay dito yung thread angle na theta and then the lead angle na alpha. Okay? Now, ito yung formula niya. Okay? So, you have to take note of this. Mahalaga yung mga formula nga. Okay? Hindi ko na siya isa-isahin. I-apply mo na lang at alamin mo kung ano yung mga parts na yun. Anyway, nandito naman nag-given yan. Yan. Ito yung mga denotion. And, meron yan. Okay? Take note of the design convention. Okay? Ano ibig sabihin nito? Plus and minus. If racing daw ang load, inire-race ng power screw mo yung load, okay? Ang gagamitin mo, plus yung sa taas, minus sa baba. And if lowering naman yung load, minus sa taas, plus sa baba. Okay? Papalitan mo lang yan. Kaya plus minus and plus minus. Yan. Okay? And, For the lead angle, okay? Yung lead angle mo, depende yan. Depende kung anong magiging lead angle mo. Kung if it is single-threaded, double-threaded, or triple-threaded. Okay? Now, L is the lead. Kung ilan yung lead mo, single lead, double lead, triple lead, okay? Three times P. Ano ba yung P? Okay? That is the pitch. Okay? Tangent alpha is equal to L over pi dm. dm is the screw mean diameter. Okay? Ito rin yun. Pwede rin ito. Kaya lang twice. Okay? Now, yun lang naman ang pag-solve sa lead angle. Okay? Take note of the following formula na binibigay ko. Mahalaga ito sa board exam. Okay? Huwag niyo iwawala yung mga notes yun to. And for the total torque. Yung total torque mo, meron ka namang torque dun sa iyong thread at thread, uh, total torque dun sa iyong collar. Magkahiwala yung torque nun. Okay? Kasi yung collar mo, uh, yan yung nakabalot dun sa screw. And then yung thread, yan yung pinakapita nun screw. Okay? And then the power applied, Tn over factor. Ngayon, recall natin. Si Tn, kapag SI units, that is 9, 5, 
4900. Kapag naman, English, that is torque over N over 63025. Okay? Ano ang unit ni torque? That is in Newton millimeter. Si N is as is RPM. Si torque naman dito is pound inch. Tapos si N is RPM. HP ang lalabas pareho. HP ang lalabas sa isa, kilo at ang lalabas sa isa. Now, the efficiency of thread. Okay? Ito lang yung pinakasimple. Pero mamaya, may kita nyo. May kita nyo yung pinaka-formula niya. Papakita. Ngayon, pag sinabing pack, tightly packed. Okay? The word tightly packed. Tightly. Yung keyword. Okay? Itong gagamitin yung formula. For the working strength. Now, for the working strength, that is WS, ST. Yun, WS tapos ST. ST is the, uh, that is the strength. Okay? Strength of your, design strength of your bolt. And then, i-multiply mo ng 0.55. This is empirical, ha? all in SI units. Okay? Then, the force. The total force for your bolt, kung ilang bolt ang meron ka, multiply mo na number of bolts. That is the total force. Now, gamit yung ating formula ni balance, yung formula ni balance, for each bolt, makukuha mo C. Ano ba yung C? Okay? C, 5,000 for carbon. Okay? That is uh, 5,000 PSI. Okay? For carbon steel. Okay? 10,000 for bronze. And then, 15,000 for alloy. Ngayon, AS, that is the projected area of the bolt. Given yun. Erase mo ng 1.418. That is in English unit. Okay. Mamaya, elaborate na. Now, for the mean diameter. Ngayon, bibigay sa'yo. Yung mean diameter kasi ng iyong screw will be yung DO outside diameter tapos yung pitch. Okay? Depende sa screw yan, yung magiging pitch niya. Divided by 2. Now, for the velocity, linear velocity nung pag-akyat nung iyong screw, that is lead. Hindi linear. Hindi yan yung linear distance. That is the lead times n. Okay? And then, mag-depende ang thread angle mo. Kung square, acme, AC, or trapezoidal, or American. Okay? Ito madalas na ibinibigay sa akin. The square threaded and the acme thread. Now, for the forms of the threads, ito yung sinasabi ko, okay? Nakadepende yung height mo sa pitch. Okay? Nakadepende rin yan sa threads. Magkaiba yung bawat isa. Okay? Pero madalas yun yung bigay dito is the V-threaded. Now, for power screw, mas magandang gamitin natin to. In order for you to get the DM, yung binigay ko kanina. Ito yun, pag sellers, square thread, tandaan mo yung keyword na square thread. 716, so DO minus 7 over 16 nung pitch. Okay? Pero pag hindi binigay, divide mo na lang ng 2. Pitch divide by 2. Pero pag sinabing square thread, mostly ganito ang formula. Okay? For ACME naman, ito lang, yung H. ACME, and then patre. Pero karaniwan na binibigay dyan is a square thread. Now, for induced distress, ito, binigay ko na yung kay balance. You have to check na lang. Okay? For pairs, ito rin. Okay, anong unit nila? That is parehong, uh, ang dito, parehong force. Tensile stress. Stress yung isa, yung isa force. Okay? And then, depth of top. Depth of top is, ito, empirical is to, ah, empirical. Empirical formula. Okay? Ibig sabihin, hindi mo mali-derive. Now, for the depth of the top, empirical pa rin, lahat ito may kita nyo sa machinery handbook rin. Karaniwan, kapag hindi binigay, yung gagamitin mo dito, binigay yung mga uh, induced stress, sabihin, induced stress, ang gagamitin mo parating una is yung kay balance. Pero pag hindi mo makuha yung kay balance, gamitin mo itong kay Pairs. Ang lalabas dyan is in pounds. Okay? Okay. 
So, yun lang. Ayun, four power screws for single set screw. Pag sinabing set screw, ano ba yung set screw, kuya? Set screw is yung mga pinangaano sa ano, yung parang allen key. Allen, allen. Allen sets. Okay? So, this is in D, that is in inches. Multiply mo nung N, that is RPM. Tapos yung D. Mali X. D and D. D is the uh, diameter. N is the speed. D is the diameter ata ng thread. Ito okay. so yung diameter nung sa circle. Divide mo ng 50. At least. Makukuha mo yung power. That is in inches. Now for power screw, ito nga yung sinasabi ko. The collar is the one na applyan mo ng load. Yung power screw yan yung papasok dun sa iyong uh, threaded member na iikutan niya. Okay? Yung outside nila, outside diameter will be the outside diameter ng collar. Yung inside diameter, that is the diameter na papasukan ng thread mo. And the mean diameter yan yung gitna. Gitna ng dalawa. Okay? Now, yung pitch. The pitch of your thread is in inches per thread. Inch per thread. Yung unit. Inch per thread. Now the lead, that is the distance in one turn. Yan yung distance na gagawin niya in one turn. Okay? So yung diniscuss ko kanina. Okay? And then, N times lead, diniscuss ko na rin to. Ito so, naman yung breakdown niya. The total power or the input power in the screw mo is pag na ito. So, yung total torque mo na lang. N over factor. Para hindi ka na magko-convert. Convert. Total torque, N times factor. But yung total torque mo is, ayan. Yung torque to overcome the collar friction, yung TF. And then the torque to overcome the thread friction. Minsan binibigay magkahiwala yun. Pwede mo isolve bawat isa. Okay? Ano ba yung formula ng TF? Okay? Kung TF. So, torque for to combat yung effect ng collar friction. Okay? FC, that is the coefficient of friction of the collar times the load or F, DC over 2. Ano ba yung DC? That is collar diameter. Yun. So, yung sa collar diameter. Lakihan natin. Okay? The collar diameter, divide by 2. This is R. Kasi ang torque is equal to yung coefficient of friction times F R. Yung R is equal to 1 over 3. Ni D O cube minus D I cube over D O squared minus D I squared. Yan yun. Na ah, iba. Now, ito yung mga pinakamahalagang formula. When raising the load, Diniscuss ko kanina, yung nandito. Pero ito, yun na lang. Alamin nyo na lang if raising or lowering. Dito na yun. Ito na lang yung tandaan. Okay? Saan na kayo ba tatandaan ko dyan? Where theta is the thread angle and yung alpha is the lead angle. Given yun. Or pwede mo rin masolve si lead angle. Again, lead angle, ayun o. So solve for the lead angle. Okay, lead angle. That is arc tan. Tan negative 1. Tan raised to negative 1. Multiplied by the lead. Depende kung double, single, or triple. Pi times mean diameter. Ang mean diameter naman, madaling makuha. Binigay ko yung formula kanina. The mean diameter is ito. Kapag hindi binigay kung square thread or ano mang uri ng thread. Pero pag sinabing square thread, that is 7 over 16 times P. Pero close enough na yung value na. And, uh, ito na yung mga iba pa ang tatandaan. Okay. Pero mostly, ito lang ang binibigay, the square, and then the act. Now, ito yung pinakamahalaga dito. Don't you forget this one. Kasi madalas tinatanong, what is the efficiency of your thread? What is the efficiency of the screw? Okay? Ito yung pinakamabisa na formula. Okay? Tan x. Ano ba yung x? That is the uh, lead angle. Tangent x plus theta 
itong uh, thread okay plus fc coefficient of to, ano collar diameter of the collar and then dm mean diameter wag niyo nga kalimutan tong formula nito madaming bumagsak sa board exam dahil sa formula nito kasi nung kasa amin uh, siguro na sa 7 7 efficiencies of that thread ang tinatanong so you have to memorize this one. Don't forget. And much of that, we'll solve the problem after this. Okay. So we will proceed with 